I'm so impressed. I'm overwhelmed. You know, short of uh, um, breath, um, and uh, I literally can't can't uh, put my words uh, together. I, I am I am really overwhelmed. I have been told that um, this thing is uh, picking up, but I haven't been here before. Um, uh, we decided that uh, we'll come here today, um, uh, have a tour around, uh, find out uh, what it's all about. Uh, in my wildest imagination, it isn't what I was looking at. I've been looking at the pictures of it in the night, uh, when it's all lit up, it was so beautiful, like Saudi Arabia, like Dubai, like what? Uh, but really to have a structure like this um, set up you know, in the contest uh, of um, uh, what uh, we have been developing at the ministry and uh, when I say what we have been this is one uh, example of what the president has been talking about the developmental agenda of the country on the back of which we are doing the 1D 1F in Ghana this is a classic example of it I am over the moon it's beautiful it's fantastic Hello and welcome to Best Tech on Ghana Web TV with me, Maoli Aholimega. On this episode, we'll take you on a familiarization tour of the Centio Oil Refinery, which is a $1.98 billion investment and also has the capacity to produce about 5 million metric tons of oil products. And this will be conducted in various phases, phases one and phases two. The refinery also has the potential to employ over 900 Ghanaians, giving them direct employment. Come with me as we join the Minister for Trade and Industry, Honorable Katie Hammond, as he embarks on this familiarization tour at the Centio Oil Refinery. This land in the no cost too much power. No, because it's a new thing and all it's it no cost much in there. Is it nice nice way or it's uh solar? Solar. Solar. Yeah. Is it yeah. daytime? He 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 uh, get it in there uh, for immediate time use. Yeah. Yeah. So this is for it's a uh, uh, light title and here and uh, the reason temperature and for the treatment of the this is a 100 pound pressure. It's a high pressure. 
Hydro-Treating System. Yeah, not complete yet. Record, this is not complete. 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 Complete
Because I we want to do something good, uh, I enjoy to Ghana. It's no Ghanese all thinking, ah, this is a foreigner. Eh, come to Ghana, only thinking for benefit matter. No. Sometimes eh, you do something good after eh, benefit you come. Eh, I come to Ghana from 2008, no? I always turn to Laila. Always turn Ghanese support me. And the BTC side, he import from outside. He buy from local. Eh, he continue to do his own business. Eh, no much different. Eh, one thing is very important to our local PTC. It's more comfortable. He no need to do big eh, working capital. He pay every side. Eh, he better in the local manufacturing. Eh, because a eh, local manufacturer, our get our town fund depot. He, he count the day can pick one draws, two draws, eh, or ten draws. He go his sir. No have any eh, price, international price matter to cover he or in a, in a city they matter eh, to keep he eh, difficult. Of course, he buy local manufacturer is better for him, no? Any investment from any country, normal rules is no investment matter, no? Injunction is no, only Ghana uh, do injunction for investment. Every country is do like that. Injunction later, no mean, is a, give me injunction, I win this money. Injunction money is a mean, is a, a support and a investment, morning go to do concession, to do machinery. Eh? No, this eh, intention benefit come my pocket. Mm -hmm. Intention is an investment law to, to bring more people come to enjoy our Ghana. Mm. What he's saying is that uh, exemptions should be looked at as money business, um, business package, but should be looked at as an enabling environment, a clean and enabling environment. Because you are going to bring almost two million, two billion dollars to come and invest, then you are giving me an exemption of X amount. You are thinking about that one. What about what I'm also putting in? Because these are machines. For the next five years, we don't even break even. So if you are asking for an enable environment, that look, I want to bring this equipment. It's not asking for uh, exemption on raw materials. It's just for exemption on machinery. And that has become a little bit difficult, which is difficult for him. Ten line is uh, okay. Okay, it's start, start operation. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, patient come commission, uh, I think also in the okay. The VDC, we have already started engaging them, spoken more of them. They came here, we discussed the conditions and to find the best way to conclude an agreement with them. What you see is when we refund, we start product available, then really the market will start. So for the moment you put a strategy, but when we start, then you know how to sell it to them. But they are all open to come here, and we talk to them every day. Mm. So there is really no issue about that. We try to have some uh, crude oil jubilee with the refinery. It's going on. The chairman has discussed with the GNPC partner, and he's going on to have some uh, parcel here. All the major trading company has visited us to propose some crude oil. There is really no issue to have a crude oil. Just agreement to put in place and the term that fits our business in Ghana. You can't do a business expose yourself compared to the market. That's all. That's all. There's no problem on the raw material in terms of crude oil supply. There's really no issue. I think many people see my face is a foreigner. Eh? I come to Ghana, it's 15 years. I like Ghana, it's like, like my hometown. Mm. Because I like Ghana, we need to do something good for Ghana, for image future for Ghana. Eh, today in the war, no? In the already eh, industrial go high. Our Ghana, we need to follow. Who can do good thing for Ghana today in the eh, energy, energy side? Refinery is key. Eh? I do this project. Eh? Future for our central group, second for our Ghana future to growing. Growing is important eh? to our Ghanaians, all because our central refinery eh? for energy side is safe, eh? comfortable. Also get a good quality, good price, 
eh, to supply to whole Ghana. So we've just had a familiarization visit at the Centio Oil Refinery where the Minister for Trade and Industry, Honorable Katie Hammond, has been visiting the facility to see how the place is faring so far. Hopefully by August 2023, the President will commission the facility, which is a 1.98 billion investment, which is expected to create about 5 million metric tons of oil product within two phases. My name is Maoli Ahonomega. This has been this week's edition of Bistec. Before we go, don't forget to log on to our website, www.ghanaweb.com. Don't forget to follow us on all our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, at The Ghana Web. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Ghana Web TV. Once again, my name is Maoli Ahonomega. Many thanks for watching. Sweet heart, be mindful of your health. Edge your products, not your makeup. I welcome you to Sigma Health and Beauty. You can call us the beauty embassy. Who pursue beauty are more revealed with quality makeup products? There is only one place. The Sigma Health and Beauty 2022 Ghana Makeup Awards. Beauty Retail Business of the Year. Of course, we are the defending champions. <laughs> World class makeup brands and quiet on. You name it. Maybelline, Dark and Lovely. House of Tara. Any, many more. Your professionalism in the beauty industry is unmatchable. About what for? Ramin the proper way of applying our products. Sigma Health and Beauty, Yewa Accra, Makwala, Georgina Stores, and Rollins Park, Gate 4. Friday in 0248-138-596 and 0201-408-186 or visit our online shop at www.beautyavenuegh.com Sigma, your beauty, our joy.